My next step is to assign my zones. So assign zones really is to create zones. All right, when I go in there, then I get two libraries, right? I get, um, uh, or image galleries, let's say. I get for commercial as well as residential. And there's a bunch of them in there, and there's some pretty pictures, and you can change the text as you see fit. Okay, I don't think I'm real thrilled with a toilet that looks like a wrench. Uh, <laughs> the bathroom, but you know, what do you got? Closet? No, metal hangers. Um, you know, whatever. You got a whole bunch of things there for commercial. You get a whole bunch, but I can always edit this text. It doesn't really matter. You can put. Um, can you put your own pictures in there? You can put your own pictures in there. Yeah. What'd you say? PNGs and GIFs, right? Yeah, I don't know what these are exactly, but um, uh, you can you can drop these in. Okay, I think these are GIFs actually. I mean, um, uh, bitmaps. They look that way. So let's say I'm doing a four-zone little bar, right? A little restaurant. So we'll start out with restaurant. I can just drag and drop, or in this case, I know I can double click. So let's say we got that, and let's say we got a little cafe as another zone. I mean, I can do one zone if I wanted to, and just have four areas in it and just control it. But I'm going to go ahead and break this out by zone, right? And each zone, realistically, is only a TV, okay? Might not be a separate room, but it's, you know, I'm just going to call it that. Um, bar, let's say you go sports bar, and we'll say the coffee room. All right, whatever. So I got four, oh, coffee. So I've got four basic zones, right? And if you notice, when I create the zone, there's a little plus mark, right? It means that there's more to it. So let's go ahead and expand that. It's telling me that it's a video zone, all right? Which may be all that we need. However, if you're doing a bigger system, you may need to make it a video zone and an audio zone. You might want to add lighting or climate control or something else, right? So you, can, you break up the hierarchy, you determine what zones are going to have what type of control going to them. Right? And then that's going to help to, to set up the interface. So I got my four zones here, and the next thing is going to be my zone construction. All right? If you're going to build your interface by yourself, and you're going to add, create all your pages and add all your graphics, and do all your programming on the, on the graphics, like buttons and stuff like that. You don't need to do this step, all right?